any white that guy you? that you say the all third? three names of, he sounds like a serial killer. Uh, you know what I mean? John, John Wayne, Wayne Gacy, Gacy, Joshua Daniel Scherer. It just has the same ring. Ding dong, ring all the Taco Bells around the world because we're making a fancy cheesy gordita crunch with the most luxurious international ingredients. I'm a dirty boy. But will V and I be able to make something worthy of the beautiful beefy original? Not as hot as I thought it was gonna be. <laughs> will I be able to overcome the fact that V thinks I'm a serial killer? Give me live fire to cook with. I swear to God, I'll be responsible. We'll grab your carry-ons and let's find out because this Gordita is so well-traveled it doesn't even get jet lag anymore. You gotta pass it so then if somebody's like staring at you, they don't know which hand you're going with. You know what I mean? No. Taco Bell, Taco Bell, Taco Bell. Calm down, they're not gonna serve us if they think we're drunk. What do you mean? Uh, may I please have two cheesy Gordita crunches? Okay, yeah. Uh, you oh, want to get the blast? Get the they they got the oh, new blasty thing. Can I have the new uh, blue it, raspberry freeze? I, I can't even see that. What size? Mean, the small or large? Let's go large. Yeah. Uh, you want the regular one or the uh, or the strawberry one? Oh, can I get one of each? Okay. I think it. Oh yeah. Do you guys have therapy here? <laughs> and that'll do it. Thank you so much. All right, break out them CGCs, cheesy gordita crunch. See, man, the CGCs. <laughs> So you gotta learn yourself some history. So the cheesy gordita crunch. Wait, let me grab some hot sauces first. It originally yeah, put was. In this, little cu this is what this pocket is for, hot oh, sauces. That's smart. All right, so oh, cheesy snap. gordita crunch. So it's a flatbread that is held together with cheese and on a, a hard taco, and then there's spicy ranch. This was originally a promo item for like a uh -huh. dollar, and then they got rid of it, but then there was such a big following for it that okay. it became a secret menu item, and then now it's a real menu item. Oh, wow. A lot of history in our hands here, V. Taco Bell fans have a lot of power. Dude, no, for real. They're like an army, man. All right. Cheese. Supple in the hand. Mmm. Wow. This tastes like college. Honestly, this might be up there with one of my favorites because mm -hmm. it's like half soft taco, half hard taco. It's the best of both worlds. There's a beautiful medley of textures because especially they solved the hard taco shattering problem, exactly. right? Exactly. By holding oh, it together. Oh, that's a good point. Like this to me is a modern architectural marvel. You got that little bit of grease from the beef combined with the cheese, the sauciness from that ranch. I like that. This is a, this is a hell of an item. This is like if Frank Lloyd Wright walked so Taco Bell could run. How can we make it fancy, Josh? <laughs> <laughs> with a mouthful of food. I'm so glad you asked me. Uh, okay, I'm fascinated by the flatbread here because to me it's it's less Mexican and more Indian. It's got that non quality to it. Mmm, sure does. I think we take a little inspo yeah. from the South Asian subcontinent right here. I think we go kind of Indian with it. There's some really good spice oh, ground meat so dishes. Nice. Lamb? Mutton. Mutton! Adult lamb, not adult lamb like sexy lamb, not lamb. like an adult toy shop. That's not what you think it it's is. It's not uncle. like it's not like really hard Lego builds. Yeah. If you see adult toys, it's not what it is. And then ranch, we're going back to making mayonnaise from scratch to start. Oh, we got to. Man. We got to. We need to push ourselves. We need to push it to the limit. I'm ready. I'm ready for the test. Let's get to it. DNA Celeste Austin. Did I use my government name? That's <laughs> crazy. <laughs> was that what your mom yelled when she was like mad at you? No, she would just say Via really loud. She'd be like, Via! Yeah. That's good, that's good. All right, so we gotta make a series of bread-like products. Actually, there's a fun lawsuit on whether or not taco shells are bread, but point is, uh, I, don't, I don't think it is. We're making, I think, I can't remember, it was Sabritas versus, this is not about Supreme no, Court cases. No, it's not, it's not. This is about it's the about cheesy gordita crunch, and it's about us, it's about us finding ourselves in uh, several layers of dough. squishy ground meat and dough. Yes. Um, so we have to make a hard taco shell. So we have a series of masas right here. We have four, do we have four different colors? We have four. We have four different colors. So this is from Masienda. They are one of my favorite masa producers because I'm the type of person that has multiple favorite Masa producers, Very I suppose. Very delicious. Uh, but they're really fantastic. They do single origin heritage breed corn that is made using regenerative agricultural techniques. I'm a big fan of these guys. Uh, so we have blue masa, we have red masa, we have white masa, we have yellow masa, and you're gonna make a tie-dye uh, corn tortilla? Yeah, I'm really excited. I do not have the artistic stones to do that. We're using Sonoran wheat flour. My favorite tortilla is in LA from a spot called Sonora Town. They import their flour from Sonora. I don't know what they're oh, putting nice. in the water in Sonora, but they make fantastic wheat to make uh, tortillas. And so we're gonna use it to make naan? Naan of like your non. Non, business. Non, I knew you were gonna say that. Stupid. It's I knew so you were gonna say that. Stupid. I hate myself for doing that. Why? Uh, I think I've said that a couple times. Puns are a refuge for the talentless. You Look say at you, Annalise. Have you ever tie-dyed a tortilla before? Uh, once. 
What? What do you mean once? You tied out a tortilla? Yes. Are people doing this? Did I, oh yeah, <laughs> we're trying. Listen, I did it yesterday. Sometimes we gotta practice because like we're, we can't just come out here raw and do it. You're an NBA player. You wouldn't want an NBA player to go out in the court without practicing, you know? Oh man, here, smell this. This is garam masala. Um, wow. I, I, That'll wake you up. I love it. Yeah, Diaspora Co. House Blend Garam Masala. This, if you get a Garam Masala from a mass market grocery store, it's just gonna be a bunch of dead spices. It's gonna reek of clove. This is incredibly fragrant with dried fennel and mace and all that stuff. That's We're gonna add our yogurt. Yogurt. Gert. Gert. We got that gert on. I like gert on. I'm a gerty boy, man. Is there, can you make too much yogurt? Are you a gerty boy? What? All right, so we also have blood orange olive oil. We're trying to get some like extra flavors into this naan to really set this apart from Taco Bell. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. We can't just do exactly what Taco Bell does. We can't beat them at their own game. We're never gonna be able to, you know? Yeah, they got, we can. They got uh, Pete Davidson. Pete Davidson's dating Taco Bell now. <laughs> yeah, he dated Kim Kardashian no and like way. Ariana Grande and now he's freaking dating Taco Bell. He's, I see all his commercials all over TikTok. What do they call him? Like a, there's like, you know the manic pixie dream girl and he's, he's like a, what do they call him? He's like a manic goblin line cook. Is that what they called his aesthetic? Does anybody know what I'm talking about? No, not at all. Yeah, Nicole knows what I'm talking about. That's her, that's her type. Uh, we're dropping in, <laughs> we're dropping in a little bit of mustard oil. I'll smell that. This is pretty wow, wild. Wow, that is pungent. So we got garam masala, we got mustard, we got the fanciest salt, pink MLA and sea salt in the little grinder they sell at the Costco. That <laughs> tastes no different than any other salt, but God did smoothie places like putting that on the menu. All right, now we're just gonna drop in some warm water with some yeast. I'm just gonna stir this together and start mashing at it with my hands. I made a masa ball. You wanna see it? Wow, wow, VNA Isn't Celeste Austin, dude. very good. Bro, you I'll can't, stop using your government you name. You can't do I'll that. Stop using your government name. Uh, you wanna uh, call me Joshua? Joshua Daniel Shear. There's good. Good. I, listen, any white guy that you say the all third? three names of, he sounds like a serial killer. Uh, you know what I mean? John, John Wayne Gacy, Gacy, Joshua Daniel Shear. It just has the same ring. All right, the naan's coming together. This is looking a little bit more yellow than normal naan. Yeah, I'm gonna keep rolling this out until it gets a little bit bigger, so, because they need to be the same size, right? We're gonna make a big taco. Yeah, yeah, oh yeah, we gotta make this gotta uh, make comically large like we do with everything. Okay. I'm gonna finish kneading this, and then we're just gonna bag it up, ball it up, and then wrap it and tap it, and nope, not wrap it and tap it, don't. Wrap it, tap oh, that's it, just and dap it. With two consenting adults, it, and Laugh it's, it, and clap it. Shake that Laffy Taffy, I'll see you in a second. You having fun over there? You look like you're doing uh, hand massaging. I'm trying to, cause hand massaging a thing? Um, yeah, it is. Really? Have you ever There's gotten a hand massage? There's one in Culver City, yeah. You just said like, well, I get, you know, manicure, so that kind of counts as a massage. They massage you? I don't know what a manicure is. Like, I couldn't tell you what verbs go down in a manicure. Anyway, so we got our tie-dye, we have our tie-dye taco shell. Someone yeah. call that a tortilla. Uh, that's great, you're gonna griddle that off? Yeah, I used a plate basically to make the shape of it and we use the same plate for that one yeah. so that it can be equal. Cause these are lying concentrically within each other. I, th I think this is gonna work and be great. They're aligned. Typically naan is thrown by hand and not rolled out, but I did <laughs> cheat. I did cheat and roll this out. I'm not gonna lie to you, I've never lied to you. Wanna see something cool? Do it. Sick. <laughs> That'd be, that was the coolest thing I've ever seen. That was like a 360 kickflip. Where'd you learn that? Um, the Tony, Tony Hawk. Hawk. The yeah. Tony Hawk. I'm brushing down the non dough with mustard oil and then I'm going to fry that up because I want to get like a little bit of texture on it from the oil. We have a hot pan. Naan's typically cooked in a tandoor, which is like a freestanding oven. And you, have you ever seen naan being made? I haven't actually. Dude, they take the dough and they just like literally take their hands and go and flap it onto the side of the clay tandoor. And then it like cooks it, but it sticks. And then you take a hook and they just like yank it off. It's sick. I want to get that a tandoor in here. intense. I would love to get a tandoor in here. Can we, everybody Wait, is it email, on our budget? Email, no, it's not a budget issue. It's a fire marshal. Email the Burbank fire marshal, say Mythical Kitchen needs a tandoor. No, they're already right? probably pissed off. Or an us. Argentinian parishada pole grill. Something, something. Give me a live fire to cook with. I swear to God, I'll be responsible. All right, so we're going to get this instead of a tandoor point Mag as we're using. Shh, magic's happening. Look at that. Okay, check this out. <laughs> Was that sick? I hated that so Sick, bro, come on. Ooh, we're getting some, nice we're getting some nice color, we're getting some nice color, we're getting some nice color, we're getting some nice bubbles. That is looking good right here. One, two, three. Nice little flatty flatbread. We're waiting for some more bubbles we're on this. We're doing good, we're doing good. And then, okay, we've had so many problems with deep frying tortillas, tortillas. into a hard yeah. shell taco. Yeah, I know. Um, <laughs> do you foresee any problems today? Um, I'm gonna say no because I'm so <laughs> confident in myself <laughs> and my abilities to do this. I, um, do you think confidence is good or bad, like overall? Um, it depends on who it is. Okay. 
That's a fair point, Mine, I suppose. Mine, 100% good. Yeah, it's good. Do you think, uh, just hear me out, do you think other people maybe whose confidence is bad also think it's good? Say it again? All right, we got our non. That's looking pretty rad right there. Okay, I'm gonna uh, drop this in the fryer. Uh, do you need, how can I support you? Ah, it's hot, you do it. Oh yeah, yeah, no, this is great. This is easy, but what do I do? Bro, put it in there. Just drop it in, but then do we like push it in? Yeah, how do we get like the shape? How do we get the shape? Just what do you like, mean, just drop it a bit of money, like no, pushing it wait, down? you're cracking it. I'm not it. cracking it, I'm not cracking it. I'm not cracking it. Oh my God. See? See? Okay, look. Down. Here, I'm just gonna put Go, it in. Just... I'm just gonna put it in. That's good, and then we're gonna, we're gonna push it yeah. down. A little bit, yeah. See, it's, then it's gonna fluff up a little bit. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, God. Leave it okay, alone. Okay, okay. Well, no, oh, my God. Oh, you cracked crack. it. No, it did not crack. Well, yeah, I feel like I didn't have adequate direction. Oh, my you know? God. I, I need direction in my oh life. Oh, my God, Josh. You didn't so... move fast enough. Good news. We're making a fancy Taco Bell tostada that costs 79 cents. <laughs> it's just gonna be a can of refried beans on a tostada shell. And okay, then right. we're gonna let it crisp up a little bit more and then land it right away on oh. this. And it's gonna form into I the see. heart shell. Like you didn't give me the context. V, you have confidence. I have none. I have zero confidence in myself. I, I put on a front. I'm, of course, I'm like, very like all insecure I think I'm people. very sexy. You know? And I think I'm awesome. Yeah, I hate myself. I look in the mirror every day and just try and spit on my own face. And then I just have to clean it off the mirror. Oh God, you tore a big crack in this no, thing. No, no, okay, no, one, two, fine. three, go. When you think of me, think of big crack. <laughs> You wanna, what do we, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta make, make a lot more. We gotta make stuff to fill it with though. Yeah, we do. Oh God. I'm excited. I just wanna go back to Taco Bell and eat. <laughs> what is that, you have a little seizure? All right, let's make some filling. Yeah. <laughs> hey V, we got a large slab of meat. Yeah, I like meat. You know what my favorite meat is? What is it? It's hot dog. Speaking of hot dogs, a hot dog is a sandwich is back on YouTube. We got our brand new YouTube channel is youtube.com slash at a hot dog is a sandwich. Nicole, you excited about it? You excited about it? Yeah! Uh, so go over, check that out, like, subscribe. We're really stoked on this coming back. Uh, and the, the audio's dropping on Wednesdays, video's dropping on Fridays. So if, if you like our faces, you can go to the video. If you hate our faces, you can go to the podcast. But either way, you will be consuming it. It will be a part of you. So this is a giant, uh, this is a whole mutton. shoulder of mutton. Which, you know what mutton is, yeah? Lamb? Yeah, but it's like, a, it's, an, it's an old lamb. So a lamb, oh god, I don't remember the, I don't remember the legal distinctions, they, they differ by country, but lamb is a baby sheep, so I think after something like 12 months, mm -hmm. it's no longer considered lamb, maybe 18 months. Um, I'm gonna start hacking this up. Uh, TBH, I don't even know how this is cut, and I don't know what I'm gonna do, but I'm gonna take a boning knife to it, and then you're gonna feed it through that grinder. Yeah. We're loosely basing our ground meat filling off of an Indian dish that's also very, very popular in Pakistan called keema. Um, really fantastic, really fragrant, we got a bunch of spices, we got liquor, we'll get to that right now. I'm gonna hack yep. this up, I'm gonna feed it through there. I'm gonna watch you struggle. Yeah, I don't I, I I don't even know where to start on this. I'm not good at butchery. You see, that goes back to the serial killer moment we were what? <laughs> Okay, we're not gonna talk about that. What? no, no, let's talk about it. You no, obviously it's not have to talk about, about it. It's not you even talking about it. You obviously have thought about this, let's talk about it. It's just the way you're holding the knife, it freaks me out. It makes butcher me feel grip, like I have man. to stand like eight feet back butcher from grip. you. You gotta you gotta you gotta flip the grip back and forth. You gotta pass it so then if somebody's like staring at you, they don't know which hand you're going with. You know what I mean? No. There we go. Supported now be just gimme, give gimme. Give okay, support me. Can you give me like affirmations? Um, you are beautiful. You are strong. I'm beautiful. You are um, a bright way. woman. <laughs> you have hair. You only know female affirmations. You, yeah. I like to do what I call um um like like negamations. Uh huh. Keep going. You know, it's like a neg. It's a negative affirmation. Tell you know, me like what? you 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 stare. You're just like you are a worthless piece of crap. But uh -huh. through, through hard work, yeah. you can reverse that process. And say so that's what I tell myself. You it's like, you it are a huge piece of crap, and only through uh, acts of labor Marmy. can you. What's going on? Wait, is this working? We called our handyman, Matty Matheson, and he fixed the machine. So now we got all of our mutton ground up. Here, toss some more in there. I and love so you. we're going to start getting this here pan going. We got a $60 jar of ghee. Yeah. Why does it cost $60? Kind of unclear. Uh, it's made from A2 Indian cows, which means people with casein and lactate sensitivities can eat it. I don't know about all that. Basically me. Basi yeah, V, here, you need some butter? No, absolutely not. So I'm gonna get the uh, uh, spices toasting and a whole bunch of ghee here. Before I put that in, V, you have the list of spices? Oh, I do. Yeah, read it off to the family. We couldn't keep track of it, so we made a list. Okay, hold on. I don't have my glasses on. 
Caramel. Uh, black cardamom, cinnamon, star anus, uh, mustard powder, asafoetida. Asafoetida. That's good. Asafoetida is the. Hold on. It's the dried bar. No, dry. No, no, no. It's asafoetida is the dried resin of the dried giant resin fennel, fennel plant. plant. Dang it! She's dried that, resin of the giant fennel plant. She's that badass undercover detective on um, BT. Asa Fatita Jones? Yeah. Uh, coriander, Indian mango powder, That's cumin, good. Um, one can of tomatoes. Yeah, it's not a spice, but those um, are tomatoes. Clove powder, onion powder, garlic powder, and turmeric. All right, so we're gonna get our ghee nice and smoking hot, and we're gonna briefly toast our spices in the ghee. That's beautiful. Yeah, yeah, yeah. hold that's on, hold on. Here you go. Okay, okay. Not I, with need, my meat I need my hand. special spoon. It's just covered has, in raw meat, and that's fine. Okay, just Sorry. drop the just drop the spices in the ghee, just right in there, and then. We're immediately, immediately oh. going with the meat. We're just trying to get this nice and frothy. Uh -huh. Be dropping the meat. Be dropping the meat. Wait, be, you gotta on. go. I'm you coming, gotta I'm go coming, fast. You gotta go fast. You gotta go fast. Watch the splash. All right, great, 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 great. More? Uh, keep going. Yeah, keep going. More. Keep going. Keep, that's good. That's good. That's good. Uh, yeah. There we go. There we go. <laughs> this is gonna be pretty greasy because that lamb's pretty fatty. Oh, yeah. get the ginger garlic. Ginger garlic. ginger garlic. I have a meaty hand. Dude, we're all covered in meat. We'll hand. sterilize the entire kitchen after this. We never do. We're gonna saute this for another five minutes, so we're gonna add some chickpea flour that's gonna soak up a little bit of that grease, and then we're gonna light it on fire. Yes, I like fire. Let's do it. What do you smell that? It's like a meat sauna. We should start a meat sauna business, should we? you and I. Would it be gross to like sit in like... Meat sauna is just called Chinese hot pot. When you go and you're just like over the bowl the whole time and it's just That's steaming me. into you. That's me. It's a good time. All right, so the chemo's looking great. It's smelling okay. incredible. <laughs> we Tomatoes? Gotta, no, we gotta light it on fire. Liquor, Let's, liquor, okay. liquor. Pour, so this is called fenny. So this is, this is not henny, this is fenny. This is a Goin cashew apple distillate liquor. It's like 86 proof, really fantastic. Pour yeah. some in there, pull Wait. the bottle away, pour in like two shots. Wait, guess what? What? Fenny thing is possible. <laughs> All right, Got pour the, the whole squad on that one. Uh, right. pour, pour it right there in the bear pan and then pull the bottle away. And then you go. And th that wasn't as cool as I thought it would be. I'm not gonna lie, I thought it would be like way cooler. <laughs> I thought it would be but too. We got, pour some more, pour some more, pour some more. Pour some more? Woo! Pour some oh, it more. smells pour like cashew more. apples. I feel like Rick Ross. Oh, oh, wait, no, you no, gotta no, tell we're fine, me, we're bro. fine. I thought you were, no, I thought you were pulling it away. Okay, the stove, the stove is, is a little bit on fire now. You wanna give me some tomatoes? And, and nobody's hurt and we're all fine. Okay, a little bit more, a little bit more. That's good, that's good, that's good. That's good, we let's, just want the tomatoes let's. to add a little bit of body. And then uh, we got this done and now we're in the home stretch. Yeah, we assemble? Gotta, we, gotta, we gotta assemble, we gotta make oh, our, we gotta oh, make our, our spicy ranch. ranch. Our ranch. Cause that is what, that is the glue that holds the cheesy gordita crunch together, except for the cheese is also the glue, but then the ranch is the glue. But our friendship is really the glue that holds oh, this together. We're friends? You're gonna let me hug you? Yeah. Church hug, church hug. You got a church hug. No, we don't touch in church hugs. We have the mutton kima right here. We have our beautiful mustard oil non-flatbreads. We have the tie-dye crispy taco shells. Those look so cool. It's look incredible, stoked. And now we reach our nemesis. This is making, making mayonnaise from scratch on camera. Not any mayonnaise, we have quail eggs. Do we know that quail eggs will actually solidify? Nah, we've never done this before. Um, so we're gonna do it. We're just gonna pop these in the blender right here. Mm -hmm. uh, so we're gonna try and slowly emulsify that blood orange olive oil in there. No, that's regular olive oil. We it's don't need regular blood. Olive we oil. blood orange in there. Um, I'm gonna add some salt to the eggs. Okay. And then you wanna take the plunger out. Take the plunger out, this is gonna be. Low and, <sighs> low and slow? Uh, yeah, low and slow to start because if this heats up too much, then it's going to really screw up the entire process. So we're gonna start whipping it like this. Okay. And then when this about doubles in size, you should see it get a little foamy. You're gonna start adding that in in a very thin stream. Very right? thin. Very thin stream. So you want about like, like I'd say 12 cubic deciliters per 15 seconds. And so that's, that gets you to about 48 to 50 cubic deciliters per minute. Okay. Okay, ready? All right, start streaming it in. It's looking nice and whipped up. We're doing a whole egg mayonnaise. Yeah. There you go, there you go. That's good. That's good, slowly but surely. V, you gotta keep a steady hand. Keep a steady hand. I'm already wanna shake. Okay, no, no, that's good. Don't, you got the shakes? Here, if you need to use my head as a rest. No, oh, wow, that helps tremendously, actually. You're welcome. I'm gonna increase the speed and you go faster, all right? Okay. It's gonna start spraying mayonnaise in your face. Look at my eye. Oh my God, it's doing it. Yeah? I'm gonna crank it to high. We're doing stuff? All right, go, 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 pour, pour faster. Keep going, keep going, keep going, we're doing it, we're Wait. making it. Oh God, you're making, you're messing me up. Okay, okay, stop, stop pouring. Holy crap. Oh snap. 
Dude! Yeah? We successfully made mayonnaise on <laughs> Yeah! Anything is possible! With uh, years and years and years of training, you too can do basic Mayo. cooking. We just got some chive, we got okay. some parsley, because this is a spicy ranch, that's what they do at Taco Bell. Need some herbage in your ranch. It's spicy. We have the hot booty sauce. It's the spicy ranch and we have Jalokia hot sauce. Jalokia is also known as the ghost pepper. It is it from the Indian first, subcontinent. Let's burn our beholes. Oh God, it's so thick and devilish. That, oh, that's no, just- Don't need more than that. Actually need less than that. Cause we got more chili peppers up here. Uh, okay, that's actually really flavorful. Like... Try it, try it, try it. No, it's really flavorful. Like you actually get the flavor of the ghost chili, which is really cool. You want to know something funny? Go ahead. I didn't even put anything on my finger. I just went like this, and it's still really hot. Uh, okay, okay. That's just too much. Just no, wait, no, good wait, because look, we still have the cashmere powder and this. I'm just gonna put the beet. This much? That's Come on. too much, bro. It's not too much. It's too, too much. Too, too, who That's thinks this too is too much? much? That's too who much. Thinks it's too, who thinks I should put it in anyways? No. Sorry, the adrenaline. Oh, no. my, my scalp is it. Put Trevor. like a smidgen of that. Oh God, you're gonna. V, come on, that's come it, on, V, it, ride the it, lightning, ride it. the lightning. My that's scalp it, is bro. itching and I have so many ideas for t-shirts. If I can't, if I can't make the rest of the day today, this is gonna be All right, put some cashew chili powder in there. Okay, I'm gonna put a little that's bit. That's gonna be good, that's gonna be good. Uh, we're gonna drop some buttermilk in there just to kind of like thin it out a little bit and then we're gonna whip it up. Butt milk. Just a little bit, just do like a, I'd say a solid like a uh, quarter cup. More, more, less. Okay, we're good. Uh, <laughs> oh no, we have more. That's what I'm saying. You thought I was playing with you right now. Okay, so this is the chocolate naga. This is actually a really incredible oh. pepper. I've tasted this fresh before, but Hold this is the dried and ground version. Uh, the naga is actually hot, hotter oh. than a ghost chili. So the naga viper came after the ghost chili and that was just before the Trinidad scorpion, I oh, believe. Man. Of course, after the red savina habanero and much before pepper X. My stomach's gonna need a blessing today. Oh, and the bathroom geez, is gonna, gonna also this. need gonna a blessing. This. Give me a little smidgen. It's a hell of a flavor. And oh, my, that's really cool. My mouth is numb to spice right now. That a little bit. V, chill, <laughs> chill, calm it back. Come on. We don't have the same hot sauce. Gosh, maybe this is just for color, dude. This is just for color. This is not even spicy. V, try it. It's not even spicy. Bro, no, I'm done. Come on, I'm done with you. <laughs> Mix it. Come on, come on. No, come no. on. No, come on. Get it. Get it. Get it. fake. <laughs> no. I mean, it looks pretty ranchy. Need salt. Need salt. Need salt. But very ranchy, very oily. Oh shoot, that's pretty freaking ranchy. Yeah, yeah. we need salt. We need a little bit of acid. Not, not as hot as I thought it was gonna be. <laughs> it's not hot. <laughs> cheese is the glue. The friendship is the other glue. Ugh, Josh, what kind of cheese is this? Hot sauce. I'm so glad you asked. So we have a, a raw milk. Uh, tongue hurts. Cheddar. We have a Cheshire cheese, also from England, and then we had two. Yeah. A drool is flowing like yeah. the river of the Ganga River. Like uh, the, the river, the waters, the get, some people call it Ganges, I think it's pronounced Ganga. More, and then we have paneer, which doesn't really melt, but it's gonna add some nice texture. And then we have a koa cheese, which Ooh, is like that's a press. Nice. It's almost like a, a farmer's cheese that's mm -hmm. pressed, and this cheese is really fantastic. So we're gonna broil this real quick, uh -huh. get this melted, and then we're gonna shove the taco shell on it, and then we're gonna get the quema on it, and then we're gonna get the ranch on it, and then we're gonna get the lettuce on it, and then we get the beans, greens, tomatoes, potatoes. Okay, great. V, cheese melted. We cheese gotta, melted. we gotta work fast. We gotta work fast. Okay, oh, so I'm get, ready. get one of the taco shells. Okay. I'm gonna swing around you. I like this one. Clockwise, and then you gotta put a taco shell in the middle, and then gotta fold it. It might be hot. It is hot. You got, oh you god. got hot oh god. girl it's so fingers. Hot. Oh god, it's so hot. I'm gonna. Oh god. Oh wait, we made it too big. That's okay. Oh god, fill it with meat. V, fill it with meat. Oh, I didn't know it's what hot. you were saying. It's hot. Fill it with meat. It's hot. Wait, towel. Hold on. There's a Do towel. You need a towel? There's a towel there. Here. Okay. Well, no, there's no you. towel in my hand. Where'd the it's towel right go? right there. God dang it. Here, here, here. Put it, I'm gonna swaddle it in a towel. Pick it up, there we go, there we go, there we go. And now, yeah, yeah, fill it with like a lot of meat. Oh, that's enough meat, that's enough meat. No, not too, finger, never too much finger meat. Finger the meat down. There it is. Shreddus? Good stuff. Uh, no, 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 ranch, 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 ranch. It goes ranch and then shreddus. Okay. Yeah, okay, ranch it up. Yeah, there you go, there you go. Yeah, okay. There you go, uh, shreddus. 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 There you go. And okay. then cheese. Cheese? Yeah, yeah. 
Okay. Yeah. Okay, it doesn't look like much now, but but <laughs> we're gonna make another one. And it's gonna look way better. Way better. I swear to God. I swear to God. I swear to God. V, there you have it. We got our fancy Whoa. cheesy gordita crunches with the tie dye fried masa taco shell. We it have looks good from the front. The mustard oil and non the back. in there with the car masala, and we got the three cheese uh -huh. blend inside. We have our lamb kima. Uh, stuffed in there, we, we got the extra sharp raw milk cheddar on top and then some shredded lettuce. God, that's a lot. Oh, and our mayonnaise, and our and queen egg boot jalokia mayonnaise. Wait, wait, it's right here. And guess what else I have? Real ones. The OGs, the original gorditas. Yep, All there right. you go. We gotta crack these open just to try it, just to remember. If Dang. we look at... <laughs> oh, snap. There is it's no so more crunch flat. in this cheesy gordita. All right, cheers. <laughs> cheers. I like it. It's not bad. Good memory. The flavor that, I took too big of a bite. What is that? Is that the death sauce? I want it. Okay. okay. I'm ready for this action. I'm gonna let you do that, but I wanna bite it and actually taste it first before. I gotta sauce every single bite no. of Taco Bell. This is how it should have been made. No, you gotta bite you it first it and nice, then no? realize how much sauce it needs extra. Disagree. And add it. I'm a pre saucer. I'm a premature saucer. Wow, right. she thick. Okay. Mm. Oh my god. Lord have mercy. That's something special. It's greasy just like a regular Taco Bell taco, but the meat is so, it like overpowers everything else and I'm very happy. So now I'm ready for ranch meat. That's too much. Get the ranch, ranch it up. Hold on, hold on, give me a second. I'll tell you about it in a second. Give me, just let me, let me do me for a sec. Wow. Okay. There we go. I'm ready for this Ghost succession. Pepper? Try that. That's what it is. Oh. I'm having a great time. I'll tell you what makes it. The meat the in the cashew room. apple liquor. You can't taste that. But it's all of those spices, Ooh, like the light. fragrance of the asa fatita, all that sauce. cardamom in there. It's like the extra dimension that Taco Bell doesn't have. Oh, and then the, the ghost pepper just makes your hair stand up. Yeah. And then, then you taste the corn from that masa. Yeah. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Still filing it. Josh, how much did this cost? Okay. Oh, I'm so sorry. That's so good. For the, oh, for the, oh, for the, oh. For the two of them, it cost huh? $247.81. Who can just eat one? I didn't want to share with you. V, thank you so much for stopping by the milk kitchen. Did you know that we do new videos every week, V? Yeah. yeah. I, no, I did it. I ain't never seen not one episode ever in my life. <laughs> And if y'all haven't subscribed, please click that subscribe Ooh. button. The, then uh, Susan Wojcicki will shove the episodes right in your face. That's the CEO of YouTube. Nobody knows that. And also subscribe to the new Hot Dog is a Sandwich channel. That's YouTube.com slash a hot dog is a sandwich. No, YouTube.com slash at a hot dog. Just search Hot Dog is a Sandwich and subscribe to the channel, please. It'll be really fantastic. Yeah. We'll see y'all <laughs> next week. It's so hot. You're too hot to handle and so is your bakeware. Get a Mythical Kitchen Oven Mitt available now at mythical.com.